let's take simple modeling for beginners this is flat head screwdriver dimensions millimeter all unspecified fillets are 0.2 mm now one is a rod and one is plastic handle now let's see total length 75 175 diameter of handle 20 length of dime uh, this handle 81 and one is step 1 mm inside and see this diameter 15 then this inside diameter we will cut letter this let's see this rod this rod length 40 plus 74 see little bit inside maybe 20 mm diameter of rod 5 millimeter and this end little difference so 30 millimeter then there is a radius we will uh, see how we can edit but this center distance is important 8 millimeter so we have to achieve this one then later we will trim this both side okay front plane is sketch now let me activate center line okay now let me activate line tool take little step down now from here convert this line into arc again convert this line into arc and connect with this okay now let me define total length 175 millimeter okay this diameter if you move cursor downward it will show you diameter if this line is construction line 5 millimeter fifteen dia and this one twenty dia okay this one I am going to suppose uh, we just uh, suppose this one fourteen okay now this one here eight millimeter okay now let me define distance 15 this one 30 okay okay this is this should be tangent so that we will get a perfect shape now distance from here to total length of handle 81 and this is step only one mm okay activate line tool extend this one now make this one twenty millimeter more okay now do one thing select this center line and convert this full line okay let's see how we can manage this go to feature activate revolve boss base feature now here i am going to select first this bottom line clear now here see there is two close boundary so which one let's say first handle line let's say this one and you will see the preview how the line is going to create keep angle 360 end condition blind okay now again i am going to use the same sketch so click and activate just simply choose apply revolve boss base now here in selected contour choose this region so see this region is selected now apply line see but here unmerge result i don't want to merge both are different body angle same 360 degree okay now if you see here 
we have two bodies revolver one revolver two okay now let's trim this body okay before going to trim this let me do this okay now these handle is curve one six remember this and see there is a detail view diameter 15 one millimeter let's see see this is the detail view now this slot cut out total length 18 now this length 10 and this diameter already given there 15 now here one thread three types of thread the gap between two thread 0.5 height of thread 0.5 distance from one end to other end 0.5 and one mm see this one mm from here to here and the gap between these two 4 mm and here also one is step 1 mm let's see how we can achieve this right plane front plane is sketch activate line okay let me draw one center line select this line make it construction line again activate line go back to the point and see the line is converted into arc select this one okay a smart dimension six millimeter and this is given one millimeter but this is still not defined so do one thing select this curve hold shift key select this line make it tangent look it it seems fully defined now this is going to remove material okay let's come this end here also A smart dimension make this 1 mm okay activate line tool connect exit now smart dimension total length 18 now this length 10 okay now the length distance from here to here 4 mm okay let's correct this keep diameter 15 okay this length 1 millimeter look it seems fully defined again activate line to let me create here thread three thread okay now select these all lines equal this is important command now select this all points okay smart dimension height 0.5 the gap between two 0.5 distance from here to this end 0.5 look trim entity power trim and keep trim entity as construction line i want to just press and hold the left mouse and drag over see this is also and this is also F fine these all are deleted okay it's time to remove material go to feature apply revolve cut because we need to remove material in circular direction so apply revolve cut now for axis of revolution select this center line now you will see all three profiles selected by default angle 360 now here you can now in, the, in this condition we don't need to select but even you can uncheck and select this body so the 
this feature going to apply only this body, not this other body. Say OK. See? Now let's uh, make this end. OK. 0.4, this thickness, 40 millimeter. Trim both sides. Now this side, I am going to trim 6 millimeter 15. OK. OK, one more thing. 10 dia, 50, 13 millimeter distance, we need to remove. And total, there are six number of patterns. Right plane, sketch, activate circle. Diameter 10. Center to center distance, 13 millimeter. Uh, look, the drawing is still not fully defined. Select center point and origin point vertical. Go to feature, apply extruded cut feature. Reverse, choose here through all. But in this condition, auto select, uncheck and select this body. So that material going to remove only from this body, not from rod, if any anything going to touch with this. Say OK. Apply circular pattern. See, feature already selected. I am going to select this. Even supposed to select anyone this, but OK. 360 degrees, 6 number of circles or cutout or uh, instances we need. See. But before going to cut this, let me apply fillet. Otherwise, difficult to apply fillet. 0.2. Select this face. This face. This one. And select this thread. Okay, now take down, now see properly applied all the fillets, front plane sketch, activate line tool, draw one center line, make sure it's horizontal and construction line, activate line. Connect with this line, make total length 40 millimeter and here gap, this is 0.4 divided by 2, it's 0.2 millimeter, one side. Go to feature, apply extruded cut, through all, change flip side to cut, see the arrow move upside. Apply here through all both. Say OK. See? Let's mirror this option. Go to mirror. Now mirror face. Top plane. Feature already selected. Say OK. See? Now top plane is sketch. Center line, line. Now connect from here to select the back side line. A smart dimension. Now this total length given is 6. And uh, the horizontal length 15. Okay. See this line going to connect back side line, not, okay. Extruded cut. Through all both, see the arrow, it is going inside. So simply choose flip side to cut. Okay. Mirror. Front plane. 
feature to mirror select this cutout and you will see the preview now let me select the body one apply the material plastic high gloss plastic green apply now this cutout this circular pattern blue see okay now select the mirror uh, part 2 body 2 chrome okay if you want to see more better to stick with okay see don't forget to share and like our video and please subscribe our channel for more video and more projects in SOLIDWORKS. Thanks for watching.